Jungle State is one of the county which is more vulnerable than other states. You, you see the, the, the crisis, the flooding that happened. We are also hearing that this year there will be a flooding. And this one, it really need support from our donors or our, our partners who are supporting us so that we need to equip this department in case if there is flood that will happen this year. It really need uh, our partners to come in and support us. South Sudan Laboratory System is um, in development. Uh, it's, um, it's really coming from uh, very far uh, where there's almost no laboratory uh, capacity uh, within the country. The World Bank has uh, been um, quite a strong uh, supporter of the laboratory uh, services uh, in South Sudan. Uh, they've been able to help us to, to recruit uh, experts who have been working together with the laboratory uh, team here in the country and have this uh, knowledge transfer. So uh, as a result of this, our, the, the country lab uh, uh, experts are now a lot uh, better equipped, better able to handle the laboratory services. The World Bank support has also been very helpful in procuring um, a lot of lab equipment uh, to enhance the capacity of the lab and also uh, reagents which really help us uh, in terms of uh, making sure that the lab uh, services are able to, to function. In these two uh, trainings, it, it was all about uh, sample management and transportation and specimen handling in the working area and as well as the, the safety of the staff working in the, in the place. This training that we have been doing have really impacted positively on our uh, working procedures here and as you can see now we are able to do a good number of testing which we are not able to do before. WHO has trained our surveillance team and also lab technician. And this training, of course, uh, help our uh, staff to have skill and also have knowledge. And even them, our surveillance and lab technician at the, at the count level we, they always even go ahead to investigate and collect the sample. There's been quite a number of very good results uh, in terms of the efforts to improve uh, lab services. Uh, we've seen quite some significant improvement. A lot of uh, testing now can be carried out within the country. We are able to diagnose a lot of uh, outbreaks recently uh, using the in-country capacity. Things like the yellow fever uh, outbreak, the meningitis um, uh, and so on. A lot of outbreaks now uh, can be tested and supported. So the lab I think has come quite far and uh, I think uh, the future is, is, is quite positive.